Hey, I'm Temporal72 and welcome to a new episode of Temporal Reactions. Yeah. Okay, first of all, Merry Christmas. I hope you had that really nice Christmas with all your family. And if you were alone, I hope you have good health and you are happy. If you haven't checked my cover of Pisces by Ginger, listen to it. Step forward, I need a new sunrise, a coward, is shivering inside, today I'll, I'll be a friend of mine, who swallows, suffering with smile, I drew a different reality. You can check the whole song right here. Okay, right now we are going to do something different. Right now we are going with hard rock and one of my favorite musicians. Okay, this is Rich Cutson. He's an amazing singer, an amazing guitar player, an amazing musician overall. He knows how to compose good songs and how to write good lyrics, how to make a good solo. And he has a similar tone to Chris Cornell. He's amazing. And I was checking that he released a song with Adrian Smith from Iron Maiden. Which is something that is really interesting. So let's check it out. Before I start, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and let me know what you think in the comments below. Also, you can follow me on Instagram and Facebook. And let's do it. This is Richie Cutson with Adrian Smith. Taking my chances. I'm really excited. Nice riff. Whoa. <laughs> Well, this is totally Rich Cutson style. You can feel that he's really groovy and he knows how to write really cool riffs. If you hear a lot of Rich Cutson's music, he goes from jazz to funk to rock to soul. So he has a lot of influences in his music. So that is really cool. Well, this started really great. <laughs> That is Adrian Smith's voice. I think that is not Richie. Richie. Really cool variation. Let's hear the chorus. Again, the main riff. Okay, at this point, it really sounds like the solo work of Richie Cutson. Uh, you can hear some of this structure or some kind of melodies like this one in albums like Go Faster, Get Up. Mm, this sounds a little bit like 24 Hours. Obviously, it's not the same. This doesn't sound like any Richie Cutson song, but it has, it really has his style. I just really want to point that out. Oh, 
I want to hear a breakdown or a bridge or their solos. Obviously, if they are two guitar players, they are going to put two solos on this song, I think. Or maybe they are going just to play one solo on one song and yeah. Okay? <laughs> okay. Nice. Nice. Those little pauses on the music were awesome. <laughs> they keep going a certain rhythmic pattern. So it was really cool. I think it was that one. But let me hear it again. Okay, they started with the but then they just keep doing some rhythmic variations to that rhythmic pattern. And at the end they were playing more off beats. So it felt like that. Yeah, it's not on the beat. <laughs> One guitar solo. I think this one is Adrian Smith. Or not? I don't know, Richie doesn't use this kind of plunger in his sound. But the legato part sounded more like Richie. I don't know. <laughs> This riff is amazing, so groovy. Nice. Nice. It's a good single. It's a good single. It's not the best Rich Cuts and stuff that I've heard, but it's good. It's on his normal level, so it, it's a good song. Like I told you, he knows how to write good melodies and how to write really cool riffs. I think a really cool part or one of his strongest skills is that he's really melodical or he's really melodic and he's really rhythmical. So if you combine melody, a good melody with a good rhythm, you have a good song, basically. And yeah, he has that really cool melodic sense. So that is great. I felt like the melody of the chorus could have been more catchy. But that is just my opinion. It, it, it was good. But for example, if you want to hear a really, really cool, really rich cuts and song, uh, you can hear Riot, that is not an old song. He released Riot like two years ago, and it's incredible. Another song that you can hear is Go Faster. Maybe you can hear some of the Winery Dogs. You can hear Elevate. It has a really cool chorus. For the standard of Rich Cotton, this was really good. Um, yeah, I, I love his music, so... Maybe I'm a little bit biased 
on this aspect. But yeah, I really like this song. So I will be waiting for the album. I think that will be all for today. I think I will be doing another reaction before the end of the year. So I will see you one more time before the year ends. So right now, I just want to say Merry Christmas. And I see you in the next one. Have a good day. Thank you.